I understand your plane is being hijacked. I asked him if anyone was hurt. There are two people lying down in first class on the floor. I... I can't tell if they're dead or alive. A flight attendant is next to me. Um, I'll, I'll ask her. Do the two this bodies... This guy told me that he thinks it's the pilot and the co-pilot. He seems to think the pilot and the co-pilot are the ones that are on the floor. He was very calm. He made me even doubt if this was a real life hijacking situation. He was very calm. But the more we talked, I knew it was for real. The plane started to fly erratic. You can tell he was excited in his voice. And he said, we're going down. We're going down. We're going down. We're going down. No, wait. wait. No. Hold on. No, wait. We're, we're turning around. We're turning around. And I asked him if he wanted to speak to his wife, if he wanted me to connect him. No, I, I can't. I, I mustn't stress her out. She's, she's pregnant. And she's going to have our third baby in January. But for any reason, if he didn't make it off that plane, would I call her and let her know in his family how much he loved them? And I told him I would. Please, do you mind? Would, would you help me? Will you say the Lord's Prayer with me? Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. And I think they just gave him the strength because after that, that's when he told me that he's going out on his faith and they're going to jump the guy with the bomb.